Hello and welcome to the final Tina's Tuesday Tech Tip of 2019. Um, it looks dark where I am at the moment, but it is one o'clock in the afternoon as I record this. Um, I am in Finland uh, at the moment on my round the world trip. And last night I'm pretty psyched because I saw the Aurora Borealis, which has been a lifetime dream come true. Um, so I just wanted to share that with you. This will be the final uh, tech tip for 2019. In the next two weeks uh, we will be off enjoying the world um, and then I will return next year with some fabulous tech tips as well. So today I wanted to show you Calendly. Now as we get into the new year it's a great time obviously um, I know you're in business and you will be reflecting on things like what are my goals for next year? What do I need to do? What do I need to prepare? Um, and if you're in the type of industry where you're serving people, which I'm pretty sure everybody is, um, occasionally you're going to need meetings with people. And this is where Calendly is fantastic. Um, so you already know I'm a pretty big uh, Google Apps fan and Calendly syncs with Google Calendar and also with iCal. So to give you a look at what it looks like, so I've got my Calendly set up in that, you know, when people ask me for a a quick chat for something, it's a 15 minute strategy session. Um, if it's something that I know I'm gonna need a little bit longer, it's a 30 minute meeting. And for all of my private coaching sessions, they go for 60 minutes. So how often I see people go back and forth and go, you know, I'd love to, there was an example yesterday where I had someone say, you know, I wanted to uh, catch up with the graphic designer um, about doing my new website in the new year. And so they sent a whole list of times. I'm available Wednesday between 11 to blah, 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 Thursday between this time, all of that sort of thing. Um, and then that person wrote back and went, oh, I can do, you know, Tuesday at four o'clock. And they're like, oh, sorry, now I've got a meeting at Tuesday at four o'clock. And so back and back and forth, we go and it wastes so much time. Um, so the way that Calendly works is you can set up your availability of different things. Um, so I've got mine all set up. Um, you know, I usually do Tuesday, Wednesday and Friday is when I'm available for meetings. And then I have all of the different times that I'm available and then I block them out. The good part is once I've set, you know, I'm happy to do meetings Tuesday, Wednesday, Fridays um, between, you know, two o'clock and 8 p.m. or whatever it is uh, that's right for you. If I book something on my iCal, which is what I use on my phone and my uh, Mac, then it will block that out automatically. So it's, it's all live and someone can't double book you. Um, so absolutely fantastic to use. And then all I do is if someone wants to have an hours meeting, I just send them this link up here and vice versa. If someone wants to have um, a 15 minute meeting, I just send them the 15 minute link or the 30 minute link. And so it takes them straight to the page. They can choose the time that they want. Um, and you've saved yourself a hell of a lot of time uh, in going back and forth. And you've got all of the availability exactly when you want it. Um, so think about who could you offer a meeting to in the new year that's going to help you build your business um, and then send them an invite and say, I'd love to catch up with you in the new year. Here's a link um, so that we can have a chat. Here's a 30 minute time slot. Just choose one that's great for you and we can have a chat in the new year about your goals. Something like that that's going to help you build your business. All right. So Merry Christmas. Thank you for tuning in so far on Tina's Tuesday Tech Tips. Um, I'm absolutely loving doing them for you uh, and we'll be doing a lot more next year. Happy Christmas.